It's a popular children's book that comes to life on the screen. Carissa Christner, a children's librarian with the Madison Public Library, is here with her bi-weekly app recommendation. And today's featured app is called Blue Hat, Green Hat. Maybe parents recognize the book. Yes, they very well might. This is by the very esteemed Sandra Boynton. She has written a ton of board books for children, and I personally love them. They are done with really good rhymes, and often they're very singable. Even if there's not an official tune, you can really easily make up a song to go along with them. Great. So about five or six of her apps have been made, or have, of her books, have been made into apps in a really nice way. They've been around for a little while. Um, but I just wanted to make sure people knew about them in case they wanted to try taking that favorite board book into a little step beyond. And this would be good for what age? Um, you know, anybody that you would read a board book to. So I would even say, like, t small infant, well, not small infants, but maybe mm, one years okay. up to, like, two or three years or older if they really like the book. Sure. So with this one, first I want to point out that uh, the, right away on the first screen, you get some options. You get, I want to read it myself, or the big guy reads it. And in this case, the big guy is the, the narrator. Okay. Um, so I always like to choose, I want to read it myself, because that way I get to choose the pace. My kid gets to hear my voice, which is their favorite voice reading, and not just because I'm a librarian, but because I'm their mom. Yeah. And um, you can also then, if you want to, read it in a different language. So for instance, if you speak Spanish at your house, you might choose to just translate it as you go and read it in Spanish instead. So that's your advice to parents yes. to do that with your kid right. instead of just saying, here's the iPad, right. go do something with yourself. Right, exactly, exactly. <laughs> Whenever possible, it's much nicer to just curl up with it the yeah. same way that you would the board book. But it's nice because it gives you a couple extra features, which I'll show okay, you Okay, let's here. check it out. So it also has um, music. If you want to add the music, I like to turn the music down because I find it a little distracting, but you okay. might like the music. I also like that they have actually a blue hat and a green hat here. Very nice. They have the silly turkey. They've got some red shoes, some clothes. Here's the word oops, which is key in this story you will find. So there's a bunch of fun props on this and just, um, you know, maybe visually explore it with your kid before you start the book and ask them what they see if they're already familiar with the story. So in this one we have blue hat, green hat, red hat, oops! So if I tap on each of those their hats kind of pop up off their head and when this turns red I can click on it and then he does something extra silly. All right? <laughs> so let's do the next page. Uh, we have a red shirt and in the book I think they're already on, right? But in the app I tap them to they're get them on, them on their bodies. Red shirt, blue shirt, yellow shirt. A way to be a little interesting Active. Oops! Uh oh, uh -oh. now we can see hearts. these boxers. <laughs> so, what I like about this app is that it makes it just a little bit more interactive than the book is and kind mm -hmm. of helps to, you know, emphasize that these are clothes that we put on our body, right? Like they're not just objects, but they're actually the action of putting them on and off your body, which adds a little extra fun. It's very cool. I find that this is actually one that's really easy for kids to read by themselves. Two. This is okay. one of the first ones that kids cuts because it's very much a pattern. Yeah. And the pictures support the text so well that this is one like my son could read when he was two because he would look at it and he would say, I know he that this is yellow pants. Without actually knowing the exactly. words. Exactly. All and right. the oops is so much fun to say. So even if you're not reading it to your child, see if they can read it to you. Very good, Krista. Thanks. Again, the app is called Blue Hat and Green Hat. And if you would like to check out Carissa's entire list of app picks for kids, go to NBC15.com and click on News Links.